Hello, in the last video we looked at compositing render passes from cycles in Blender. Um, we created a network of nodes to both recomposite our beauty pass as well as doing some cool things like changing colours and even retexturing an element. I received a comment on that video from 4th Dimensional Hyper Sausage that says the following I'm super tired of moving the cursor around and clicking so much, there must be another way. As luck would have it, I have created a node group that makes the process a little bit quicker and definitely simplifies the layout, so let's look at that now. Okay, I have a new Blender project open and we're going to jump over to the compositing tab and check use nodes. Just give ourselves a little bit more space here. Okay, we can delete our render layers, import our multi EXR image that we have rendered out of cycles. You also might need to come down to layer and select view layer just so we can see all the passes. And now let's append our pass combiner by going file, append, selecting pass combiner, going to our node trees and choose pass combiner. Now what we can do, shift a group pass combiner. As you can see, you just need to connect the names and that's it. So let's connect our combined, set up a viewer node. That's what the raw beauty render looks like. And this is what the combined render looks like. As you can see, they are the same. So now you can do things like, I don't know, let's add a mix node. Let's increase our ambient light a little bit by going to from the diffuse indirect. And we can crank this up to eight. Give that a little boost. Oh, that's a bit too much. Let's go to four. Let's duplicate another one of these. Let's crank up the shininess. Let's go glossy direct. Yeah, it's big. Anyway, you get the idea. And you can download this node from a link in the description. Thanks very much for watching.